today we are going to establish the OSPF routing between these three routers so I have already configured these IPs to save the time so let's start with the OSPF routing so let's start with this router router R1 and now let's configure the IZRP routing so for that first you need to go to the global config mode by this command uh, now to configure the OSPF router uh, we have to <coughs> uh, issue this command router OSPF and here you need to enter the process ID and you can use any number between 1 2 6 5 5 3 5 and it will create the OSPF instance with that number and it may be different uh, from router to router you can use any number it doesn't matter that uh, like in EIGRP you have to use the same autonomous number and keep in mind that this is, this is not the autonomous number this is a process number so you can use it uh, any uh, process ID now configure the network so in OSPF we have to provide the all the network IDs so for this the network ID is 10.0.0.0 and for this network ID is 11.0.0.0 and for this this is the 192.168.1.0 network and guys uh, I have used slash 24 CIDR for 192 networks and 10.0.0.11.0.0.12.0.0 uh, these has slash 8 CIDR so subnet mask will be 255.000 for these networks and 192.168.1.0 the subnet mask will be triple to five dot zero so let's add it network 10.0.0 and now we have to enter the wildcard mask so for this uh, uh, 10 0 0 we have to subtract 255 uh, we have to subtract from 255.255.255.255 so when you subtract to the subnet mask uh, there will be 0.255.255.255 and now we have to enter the area number so enter the area and for area you can use any number between 0 to 4294967295 and keep in mind that the area must be same for the every router that you want to perform OSP routing right so I'm gonna choose the area number 0 here now add the next network network 11.0.0.0 set network and the subnet mask will be like this area is the same now at the 192 network and for this wildcard mask will be this so yeah we have done with this router now here the networks are 192 2.0 10.0 12.0 So router OSPF I'm going to use here 2 as the process ID and network will be 10.0.0.0 0 0.255.255 0 .255 and area will be the same guys another network is 192.168.2.0 and area with the 0 so command is this and since uh, it is finding the adjuncies that's why it is showing these lines 
and also the process uh, instance has been created now let's configure the SPF routing on this router go to the OS control global config mode now add the networks network 11.0.0.0 other network is what was the real network the network is 12.0 now let's perform the uh, check the routing table So guys you can see all the neighbor network IDs has been known by this router and all the directly connected network has also been known and you can see that 19 10.00 12.00 11.00 and 192.168.1.0 network has been found but it is not showing the 192.168.2.0 network now it is showing now let's ping the pcs guys let's wait for a little more guys now you can see that it is pinging now let's ping from this PC also so guys you can see that it is pinging and since the OSPF routing has been established that is why it is pinging so thank you guys